So this is an awkward um, position right now. I'm just on the landing of the stairs. Um, I told to make this video because I thought I'd just change how it, how I, how it, you know, how it looks. Like normally I'm all sitting down in the same position, same place. So I thought, you know, let's just do it. Let's let's stand in a different position. But yeah, just I don't know. Just the last month or so, I don't know, just being really shit, feeling depressed, you know. And the re I think the reason for that depression is the fact is, it's the my, it's my anxiety, it's my, sh it's how 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 I am, you know, it's because I how I feel, um, and you know how I feel, you know, I'm in, just how I just am, you know, just it gets me down because I don't, I wish I could just be, I wish I would just, I wish I just weren't, I wish I was wasn't so emotional, I wish I wasn't so sensitive, I wish, um, I wish I could disguise my problems more, um. I wish I'd, I wish I didn't have social anxiety. I wish I was outgoing. I wish because if I was outgoing, you know, I would, you know, I dating would be easy, and I wouldn't have to. I wouldn't be talking about all this stuff, you know. I wouldn't have. I wouldn't be going into detail about stuff I want to do with women, you know, sexually, you know, um, which I have on the channel. Again, if you haven't seen that stuff or you're curious, check it out on free, which I'm not doing that anymore. I'm doing without that now. I've got what I've got up. But, um, well, that's one thing that's changing now. I'm trying to stop doing the same things over and over again. But this year, I want to try and meet someone. And I've got that fear of meeting someone, you know, and it not happening, it'd be like before, like, it not working out. But I've got to get over that fear. I just think, I just think, dates, even if it don't work out, there's opportunities of piggybacks, you know. I can get the piggybacks, you know. I think, if it don't work out, I can get a piggy at least get a piggyback of them, you know. And video it, and they've got that memory of it, you know. So that's what that's worth. Just, just just the fact of that happening makes it worth it, you know. Even if it doesn't work out, just, just think of all the piggybacks I can get, you know, of all the women I date. If, if it just takes several, so like, but well, I never know. I might meet someone, and she she might be the one that I end up dating. Then, um, then hopefully she'll be, um, give me, you know, hopefully she'll be just the one that's giving me piggybacks. Um, I don't know. It's just like, this whole. Piggyback thing. The reason I like it so much, I've said, I've said before, but it's not. I don't, I don't like it in like a childish, like way. Like, that's the thing. I don't want people to get confused with. But then again, I like it kind of. I just like it intimately. I, was, I like how. I, just, I don't know. I just like it how it looks. But when I just, I, I just like the idea of a hot woman giving the piggyback. I, I even like seeing two hot women give each other piggybacks. I find that hot. You know, there's something, something about women in, doing piggybacks. I don't know. I just find hot. You know. Um. And I just see the thing's hot, and I just like I like how it looks, and and I think it feel nice. It just feel nice because you're right against her, innit? You kind of like intimate. You kind of I'm right. <laughs> That's what I like about it so much. So yeah. So yeah, it's just weird, but yeah, but yeah, but just think of that. All the chances, you know. Things, things. That's the thing. Um, I'm not doing the things I want to do. That's the problem. So that's what I need to do. I think the way to the one thing that's going to help my depression is to do the things I want to do. That's, yeah. And there's my Uber. And then that Uber, like, I've got food to live with. Yeah, I don't know what it is. I don't know why I think it's, it's, it's I like how it looks and I think it's, I think it's hot, you know. I don't know, but I need to have this, my brain seems to be fixated on them. My brain's kind of, but I don't know if it's some kind of, <laughs> but, but I don't know if it's some kind of thing in relation to anxiety, OCD. Because OCD, you have a, it can cause obsession with things. So I don't know if that's one of them. I seem to have an obsession with that. Um, but um, you know, it's it's, I, I, it's doable. You know, if it, if it is, I found no way around it. You know, if it, if it just does it once, I at least want to try her to try it. And um, if not, there's other ways, and I just do the. I can just like I can just you know just sit behind her, you know, you know, be behind her and whatever, and yeah, stuff like that. I found a way around it. I don't just go into detail about that, but yeah, I don't know. That's, I don't know, that's one of the first things I really want to do. I just really want to do it. I just want to make it happen, which is frustrating. I think even if I do, just, do, just doing that is one of the first things I want to do. It'll be one step forward to me being, me feeling fulfilled, you know, feeling like I'm starting to do things I want to do. But I want to do other stuff in life. It's not just that. So I want to, 
I'll eventually, well, I'll, if I want to go abroad, I really want to do that eventually. I want to want to go on holidays. I want to do more things. Um, there's a lot of things I want to do, which I want to make happen. Because if I don't, I'm just going to get old and die and miserable, you know, unfulfilled, you know, and you know, an happy um, person. Which I don't want to. You only have one life. Or just do things you want to do, you know. So yeah, I don't know. I just need to do it because it's just, it's just making me fucking depressed. It's just so frustrating. Cause I want to do it, and um, it's as simple as just going on, the, just meeting women. I've just got to take that risk, haven't I? And um, you know, I need to. Ex I need to. Ex I just need to understand, which I can. You know, the thing is about that's a good thing about online dating and stuff. The fact is, you can explain you have anxiety. Um, because obviously before I meet someone, I'll, I'll want to chat with her, video chat and speak on the phone. Or I'll speak or like just do a video chat because I want to know, because I'll be doing that just to make sure she is who she says she is. And I know how, and also to get an idea of what she's like. So it helps me feel less nervous when meeting her. So yeah, but yeah, it's just, it's just, it just happened. And, and I said, I don't want to keep, I'm not making, not making any more of those videos I've done. We're like one month into the year. And I've kept my words, and I'm not making. I don't plan to make any more videos. I haven't even had the urge. Of all I've done is the only, the only urge I've had is to make this video because because I think I'm, I've, I think that's one of the problems. I think this is one of the causes of my depression and my feeling depressed is that because I'm not doing things I want to do. So that's what's causing it. And I think that's one thing that's not helping. I think that's one of the causes of my issue is not doing things I want to do. Um. So I want to do I want to do more stuff, but that's one of the first things I seem to want to do because I don't know why I seem to be obsessed with it. I don't know why it's annoying. I can't seem to stop thinking about it, and so and it's weird. But but OCD is weird. O I'm guessing it's OCD. It could be related. It could be to do with OCD uh, because OCD, you know, you know, obsessions, you know, or so or so. It's obviously something that's like causing it. Yeah, I don't know. But uh, yeah, it's, yeah, yeah. Next video.